Hey girls and boys, I'm Abby Brown. I don't know about you, but I think sea lions are pretty cute. They always look like they're having fun. They can walk on land with their flippers and swim very fast in the water. Plus, it seems like sea lions understand humans. It must be because they are so intelligent. Here at the Blank Park Zoo in Des Moines, the sea lions love to work with their trainer and show off for anyone else who's watching too. Get ready to get a little wet and go a little wild with Iowa PBS and the Blank Park Zoo as we learn about sea lions. Do you have a dog at home, or hamster, a cat, or maybe a parakeet? Some of the pets that we live with are highly trainable, and some just do their own thing. But at the zoo, there's one group of party animals that love to be trained for the spotlight, sea lions. Thank you, Abby. My name is Shannon McKenney, and I'm here at Blank Park Zoo in our hub harbor with Zoe and Addie, our two beautiful sea lions. We are joining a training demonstration right now. As you can see, Zoe and Addie are working with their trainers behind me on a variety of different behaviors. Here at Blank Park Zoo, we use something called operant conditioning or positive reinforcement training, also known as clicker training. You may even hear the clickers behind me. The clicker is what's known as a bridge. And what it means is that the behavior we've just asked, the animal did beautifully, they hear that click to know it's exactly what we wanted, and then they get a delicious yummy treat. In this case, it's fish, which is their favorite. A lot of the behaviors that we do with the sea lions are to help with their health care or husbandry training. So things like drawing blood, ultrasounds and x-rays, and even just a checkup, so lifting their flippers or opening the mouth, just like you would do if you went to the doctor or the dentist. We also do a lot of fun behaviors that show off their athleticism. Sea lions are amazing athletes. They have high speed and great jumps. Zoe and Addie are eight and nine years old, and they came to us from the wild. Our two lovely ladies were stranded as pups and unfortunately could not survive on their own in the wild. So that's when they moved to Blank Park Zoo and became a part of Blank Park Zoo's family. These two girls are wild and full of spirit. They love to learn and they love to show off. When you visit Blank Park Zoo, you can see these two girls showing off to the public with their fun, exciting, and adventurous behaviors. You'll see big jumps and high speeds on these ladies. They are so much fun to work with, but you have to be two steps ahead because they're always thinking of fun ways to mess with us. Thank you so much for joining me and Zoe and Addie. Now we are gonna go over to the giraffe and see how we use the same training with these guys that we can do with our giraffe friends. Come join me. Now before we get started, I just want to mention a few things. You will see myself and our trainers wearing masks, and that's because we're trying to protect and keep the animals safe. So don't worry, we just want to make sure all of our animals are safe while we're working in close contact with them. So now we'll get over to the training. This is husbandry training. So what that means is we train behaviors that allow us to take better care of our giraffe and allow them to participate in their own health care. So some of the behaviors you'll see are we might look at their hooves or their tongue. We can target them. That's what that little ball on a stick is. And when we target them, that allows us to hold their focus and get them close to us. So if we need to train a new behavior or a different behavior, we can use that. You'll see our keepers giving out nice yummy treats. Our giraffe love apples and sweet potatoes and carrots as their fun yummy treats. Some of the different behaviors that we do allow us to do more detailed health care. 
so we can draw blood from our giraffe. We even x-ray their hooves. Did you know that giraffe get pedicures? Ours do. We have a farrier who is someone who focuses just on hooves come in and file our giraffe hooves down to keep them healthy and to help them with their walking. Let's see if we can see some of the fun behaviors right here with Skye. Skye is uh, one of our younger giraffe. She is six years old. And you can see the trainer is working with her to back up. And the tongue, look at that big long tongue. We can also do a side present. So if we need to get to just the side of Sky, we can do that. And so we can get a nice look at her whole body. Well, thank you so much for joining us at the giraffe training session. Thank Aren't those African species incredible? And I told you those sea lions were cute. I hope you learned as much about them as I did. They are extraordinary creatures. Thank you for going wild with Iowa PBS and the Blank Park Zoo. I'm Abby Brown, and as always, remember to ask questions and wonder. That's what science is all about.